Hey guys, Anthony here from The Hot End. I've got some very exciting news coming up. Stick around. And thanks for coming back. Okay guys, big announcement. Thanks to Folga Technologies, I shall be at Maker Faire 2016 in New York. Uh, that's right, John's flying me over to meet everybody and to chill out at uh, Maker Fair, and that's going to be awesome. I'm going to get a heap of cool footage and I hope to meet up with uh, Jerry, Joel, Jason, Preston and maybe Angus. He's still up in the air, not sure what he's doing yet, but hopefully he makes it too. Um, also got uh, some new printers coming from See Me CNC. They're nice enough to send me the new Aries that they've been working on. And they're also got a new Rostock Max coming out, which um, they're gonna be sending me shortly. So I'm gonna do some cool um, build videos of that, uh, the kit and, and testing with the Aries. I think that's gonna be really, really cool. In relation to the Slice of Wars videos, I hit a little bit of a snag. Um, actually having really hard time differentiating the prints. They're all coming out perfect, which I didn't think would happen, but it is. Um, I've put in three or four really difficult prints and I've mirrored my settings across all of the slices. And the issue I'm having is that they're coming out the same. So if I shuffle over, I'll show you up here. That's the um, skull spinning around, which you may have seen in one of my quick teaser videos and that is the temperature tower. Now, I was hoping for some cool TV by showing you, wow, look at this one, this one sucks, and this one's awesome. But the issue I'm having is they're all coming out the same. So I may just go into showing you the differences between the slices, going through the UIs, showing you some of the cool features. Um, if you'd like to see that, give us a shout out in the comments, or if you've got any other ideas of how to torture test each of the slices so I can get some differ differentiating results, that'd be cool. Now I'm not doing simple test cubes, I'm actually doing the hunter's skull. Um, I'll show you, well you'll see up here, but that's not a simple print and all of the three slices have just smashed it, no, no issue. Um, you also might have seen that I was very critical of the new Cura about not allowing um, people to add in their own printers anymore. Um, that's still the case, haven't changed my stance, I think they need to address that and fix it and make it easier. But in saying that, once you've got your printer in, and if you allow for it slower to slice in comparison to the other two, the software works really well. Alright guys, so I hope to see you at Maker Faire in New York, this is going to be awesome. It's going to be the first time I've left the country, um, so I'm not looking forward to the 36 hour flight via Dubai I think. Why Dubai? No idea. Um, so yeah, I'll be flying from Melbourne to Dubai, Dubai to JFK, and then uh, flying out again uh, probably about a week later. So if you'd like to catch up with me or any of the other guys, um, yeah, just look out for us at Maker Fair, and I hope to see you there. Cheers, guys. I see the lights in your